Grand Rising and Shining Radiant Souls. So today's daily reading is from the Mary Magdalene Oracle by Megan Watterson. And the message today is true love. All exists through love. It's important to know that love laced with lack and ego is nothing ever to be ashamed of. Repeat this statement several times if needed. The whole point of being here is to be fully human. This means we fall in love with the wrong people. This means we will too, we will be too terrified to love the right people. We will do all the wrong things. And this is what's meant to happen. It's brave to break your heart wide open. It's brave to dare to love. It's only in our messy, mixed up, and wildly imperfect attempts at loving that we can practice expanding our capacity to love. We try and fall and try again to love and be loved. And in that effort, over time, and with mercy, we begin to let love reach within us where it has never been before. We begin to forgive ourselves and others for things we had judged unforgivable. We begin to see that love is an energetic exchange, a flow, and that miraculously, somehow, the more we give, the more we receive. And we begin to see that this may be the whole point to being here feeling all the possible love we could feel, and without any control or contriving, we give it all away, knowing as we do, trusting even that this inner source of love that we are giving from is actually inexhaustible. The Gospel of Philip says, the companion of the Son is Miriam of Magdala, the teacher loved her more than all the disciples. He often kissed her on the mouth. If we take this scripture to heart, we realize that Mary and Christ were spiritual partners, companions. We realize that the love between them was meant to be a teaching on the power and the possibility of true human love. The Gospel of Philip also says, Love refuses nothing and takes nothing. It is the highest and vastest freedom. All exists through love. This is the form of love, I believe, Christ and Mary shared. A love that is more than love. A love that is the highest and vastest freedom. A love that makes all things possible. The soul voice meditation question is, who in my life can I give love to in this moment? And of course, I give my love to all of you watching and tuning in, but also to myself. Such a beautiful message today and a reminder to keep loving. And we are brave. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, I'm sending peace, love, and soul.